Ah, it's so again on. Because it's recycled. Another red vehicle, right? Soldier they're using red. Bullshit. You can just see better now. Yellow here. Another perp here. Yellow. Right. I know this program puts a blur over the cursor, so I just want you to look so you can see it. Two of them in yellow. Again, one here. One here. You see right at the end, there's that woman. There's two people in yellow. It's like it's that shade of yellow they've been using to target me. Um, Another Especially guy. Especially women. It's just gone now. Right like here. There's the church, right? The chapel or whatever it is. Now, as soon as I get to it, car pulls out. This is kind of shit that they're doing. Just, uh, fast forward. Just find it. So, a guy walks past, which I didn't film because I wasn't sure if he was a perp or not. And this car was down here. There's like a um, car park. It's funny because I get someone commenting on my YouTube saying, Do you have a friend in Jesus? It's like, I've already been over this. I don't really believe in Jesus. I believe in God. I don't believe in Jesus. But I guess they still using that theme to try and target me with i'm not an atheist i believe in god but I, i'm not saying jesus didn't exist or someone who jesus was based off doesn't exist but as for your image of jesus christ blue eyes white and him walking on water and turning water to wine and all this stuff uh very skeptical about that to the point of like 99.9% .9 skeptical of that. So, do I have a friend in Jesus? No, but I have a friend in God. So, anyway. Continuing on. So, this guy is the guy that passed me. He's just stood there, right? Like a zombie mode. <laughs> he's, he's just standing there. I think he had... Yeah, I think he had one hand in his pocket, possibly. I can't tell. But this car pulls out. Same time exit, entry tactic. And that guy was just stood there for like five minutes. Just, well, not that long, but, you know, an unusual amount of time. To, just to get your attention. He was just stood with his back to me for about a minute and a half. Just stood there. Doing what? There's nothing there. You know? That's what I mentioned now. There's that fox. Yeah, so the first taxi with that fox in. I'll try and get the number plate so you can see it better. There's that fox. This is an example of conditioning. I don't want to get the plate. So I managed it the other day. I will get it. I managed it. That's like Fox. This is Fox Cars. There we go. MF fifty six Fox, right? So you know, they know what they're doing. This guy is like a little smirk on his face when he's going past fixation drill again they love to use taxis that's what i'm saying about that fox taxi bullshit yeah keep sending that shit of course well actually i'll get onto this in a minute they like to use certain companies and for me they use the sas cars 
and this woman just comes out of nowhere with the tag team. There'll be people coming out of left field all the time. Okay, it's like they wait for you. Like today, for instance, as soon as I get to this park, guy comes out of the house looking, he had that blank face, mind control look on his face. They mind control people to come out as well. Yeah, as soon as I get to that little church chapel thing. They do mind control oh, people around you. Something I like to do. With the um, silent sounds and the microwave auditory effect weapons. Although a lot of them, not all of them, but quite a lot of them know what they're doing. But sometimes it's hard to tell. Like this guy coming up now, I'm pretty sure he knows what he's doing because you'll see him try and hide his face. Like he doesn't seem surprised to see me filming. It's like he knows I'm going to film and he's trying to hide his face. So this guy here, hoodie, one hand in his pocket, you can see his body language. He's trying to look away from my phone. He's trying to hide his face. See? Look, what he, look, at, look at how he's acting. He's, there's nothing of interest over here. But this is a perp, you know. He, he's trying to hide his face so he's not on camera. Look, you see, even now he's turned it even more. He's like turning his head as much as it will go to try and hide, you know, being exposed. But he, again, you know, the one head. One hand, one hand in pocket, I mean, targeting, which you can clearly see. I've got a clearer view of him. It's like, a, I guess, a construction worker. Got uh, construction trousers. Don't know what he's got in his hand, but... I think it's some kind of tool or something. Anyway, um... One hand in pocket shit again. See what I'm saying? And you could tell. You just tell it's a perm, he, just by how he's acting. Like, he's, acted. he's not looking surprised. It's like he's intentionally away. hiding. And this guy here does a hand signal. Well, he's on the phone, the phone targeting. And he's just in the, you know, in the window when I come around in this building. Phone targeting. He was trying to look away. Didn't want to be on camera. Alright. Car starts its engine. Yeah, another tactic. Car starts the engine as you walk past. And as I walk past, another tactic. Another tactic they like to use. Anyway, I'm pretty much here now, so. out of the car just there uh, should see that again you know when you get to your destination there'll yeah. be people especially somewhere they don't want you to go like the job center so this guy just gets out of the car when I come down this is like the classic and puts the boot up that's something yeah, again Puts the boot up, doing that, just like the fireman, like just like the woman the, the day before this, the opens the boot. Open the boots of the cars. The trunk, if you're in America, we call it, we call it the boot in the UK. I don't know why, but yeah, same thing. I think you call it a uh, windshield, we call it windscreen. So, yeah, there's a difference, but it's the same thing. What happened then? Oh, it's still going. I'm thinking shit, is it? 